Hello, John here from MT2IQ, and I'll be showing you how to install the bot. So you're just going to go to the website and click the download button. And wait for it to download. Then you can click the icon here and click the folder button. Right click and select Extract All. Click Extract. Then go ahead and select and click Enter to open the software. Click Run. Click Yes. Accept the agreement. Next. Next next again, install. Go ahead and click finish. Then you're going to enter in your email and password for your IQ option account and click OK. But you also want to click save password, it'll make it much easier for you. and you'll be logged in. Then you need to go ahead and go to the MetaTrader folder. And if you don't have an MT4 already set up, you can go ahead and install the Alpari in here. Click Run. Click yes. Next. Click finish. Just close this. And then you can go ahead and do file, open an account, select a demo account with the lowest ping and click next. New demo account, next. Then enter some info in there and click agree to subscribe so that the next button will be enabled. Click next and click finish. Then you're going to go to file, open data folder, MQL4, indicators, And you're going to go ahead and go back to the MetaTrader folder, MQL4, Indicators, copy the EX4 files, then you're going to go up one to the Libraries folder, then go back here, up one, Libraries, Copy the library file, then restart your Alpre MT4 or the other MT4 that you're using. Then you're going to select Minute Chart and go to Insert Indicators Custom Binary Profit. Click OK. Um, the other thing I want to touch on quickly is the buffers. So basically what this is is, uh, is a 1 for the put or down arrow and a 0 for the call arrow. 
So you have to be aware of that if the buffers are different. You might need to. Okay, so that's that. And you can go ahead and do right click on the chart, chart and select properties. Common. Turn the grid off. So it's very ugly. And you can go ahead and change it to candlesticks. And you can change the colors if you want. Customize it. Okay, so that's that. And then you can go ahead and insert indicators, custom. The manual plugin if you want to go ahead and do manual trading. You can set it up for one minute or five minute expiries or however many minutes you want. And Insert Indicators Custom MT IQ Connector. So that, as I had mentioned about the buffers, so the zero was for the call and the put arrow is for the one. So you have to make sure that those match for your indicator. And you need to enter the indicator name, case sensitive, which is binary profit no spaces capitalized and then you can enter in like this binary profit like that and you can have the uh, ex entries on new bar so what that means is say for example you get the dot here so the entry would be at the open of this next candle or it can be intrabar, which means the signal would enter right away here as you get the uh, dot entry, dot signal. You can either set up Martingale on next expiry or no, Mar or no Martingale and set up the number of steps. So if you want uh, two steps or as many as you want, seven steps so on and you can either set up for coefficient of 2 or 2.25 whatever you prefer so click OK so now you can see that the it's all set up everything is okay now and if you want to do back test you can turn the chart shift off and scroll back then go back again so what you can do is right click on the chart and select template, save template, binary profit. And then when you go to create a new chart, you can just right click on the chart, select template, binary profit. It'll be all set to go. Just make sure it's on one minute chart. One minute chart, right click, template, right near profit. You can drag it, drag your pairs and order them. So that's how it's done. Go ahead and close this. And I'll go ahead and show you a uh, entry here. Call. And it enters here.
and you can see that it's entered on the binary uh, platform here. Alright, thanks for watching.